straight pour. Hopefully get wings. I have Artist Loft White uh, with Satin Enamel, two tablespoons, and Floetrol to the desired consistency, mound upon mound, and it leaves trace and then disappears. Arteza Bronze with Floetrol. Arteza Crimson Red with three drops of black, and that was up to here. I've used some of it with Floetrol to um, consistency. Artist Loft Navy with Deco Art Sapphire Metallic. And to consistency. 24 karat gold from Deco Art. And Peacock Pearl from Deco Art with Apple Barn or <laughs> Apple Barrel Caribbean. I get that one wrong every time. It makes the Apple Barrel Caribbean, which is a Walmart non-metallic, it turns it into a pearlized paint. All these are Floetrol to the consistency that you need, which is thick, uh, mound upon mound, and trace, and then it disappears. Navy, I always do navy first because I like the night skies. And then I am going to do white. The copper. Here I'm going to put this crimson red color. The copper has a lot of red undertones, so that should be nice together. Some gold. Hmm. I'm layering a lot of metallics. Um, metal colors. White. going in. Really use all this copper. <clears throat> Tiny bit of this red. Okay. Right. 
my cup. Let me reposition the camera and I'll um, get my canvas on the table in the center and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. And ready to pour. And here we go. Sorry that it took so long. <laughs> I was concentrating so hard. Oh, I got my wings. This is looking so good. Oh, I love all those metallics together, the actual metal colors. I see so many bubbles. Okay. I'm going to spread the white. I'll be back. Okay. Got the white all spread out, and it's time to stretch. I've got massive amounts of cells all in here. Oh, this is so pretty already. Let's see. I usually go this way, so I'm going to go real slow like I usually do. center. I'm going to go to this corner. Go flip. <laughs> That's how I get it over the corner. Oh, look how beautiful this is. Wow. I'm really impressed. I'm really excited. <clears throat> the colors are just phenomenal, and I've got symmetry on both sides. It's just so pretty. I'm excited for y'all to see the, the finish. Hopefully, I won't mess it up. <laughs> Been known to do it. I 
this looks like an alien landscape. It's just, I'm so excited to show you this. I'm sorry. I just, when you get something that's just exactly what you were hoping for, it's, it's a great joy. Oh, I don't want to lose all my cells there. <clears throat> Can't wait till the weather completely changes. It just wreaks havoc on my asthma when the seasons change. going to go ahead and come back to this corner. I wish it was a little bit thinner, but I don't want to knock all those gorgeous cells. The cells are amazing up top, and I don't want to lose those, so that's all I'm doing there. I'm going to mess up the center com composition. It's just, this is wild and beautiful. The colors turned out so pretty. I think I've said it before, but be sure to scrape the edges of your painting after you've done the pour and your stretching because the paint is still being pulled off the canvas if you don't do that. And plus it'll also leave a puddle underneath, you know, all those drip marks and stuff that'll puddle up and it's not very pretty. save my paint for the corners, what's left in the cup. And the edges here. Just in case you missed something, we've got some of the same paint. Oh, this is just, I'm so excited. I cannot wait to show you. Okay, here we go. Here's kind of an overview, and then we'll go in. Here's the bottom part. Look at these cells. They're just beautiful. And they go in a line. They just one right after another. Multiple colors. And this whole wisping with the, the bands stretched out. That's the corner. Look at that. Oh, that's so pretty. I got my angel wings. I'm sorry, the photography is leaves much to be desired. Like I said, it's it's old technology. Um, I'm doing it with a camcorder and tapes. <laughs> so I'll go up to the top. Look at all these cells. They're just cells upon cells upon cells. Oh. It, 
it's just so exciting when that happens. Look at them. these big loppy cells and I'm going to go right to the center I, ho I hope this is coming across there look at that isn't that beautiful that's just amazing all the movement that I got in in stretching these bands open I cannot be happier with this painting. It really does look like something that's alien and it's so cool. Okay, well, please like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment. Thank you so very much.